Greetings, Lockhart Knight here. Today we follow NC Tower Hunter and his gaggle buffoons as they audit a probation office. Why are they auditing a probation office? Because they're a bunch of incompetent morons who have nothing better to do. So let's sit back and watch the show. Enjoy! Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. All right, guys, y'all want to see cockroaches scatter? Just break out a camera. No, I particularly don't like watching cockroaches scatter. It just means I have to track them down and kill them before they breed. Oh, wait, that's not the type of cockroaches you meant. Do you mean yourself? Mm. All right, yeah, uh -huh. mm -hmm. Nobody in here. Wow, well, that's crazy. No, it says no cell phones. Wow. Smoke tree. Uh, I'm just here to uh, press on the government a little bit. Mm -hmm. okay, yeah. yeah. Just about if you're not on probation and parole. Is that a law? Isn't this a public lobby? No, it's not. It's for probation and parole. That's right, cockroaches. That's the Department of Probation and Parole. I've been an affiliate of the Department of Corrections, which is not open to the public for reasons of security, you morons. Oh, oh no, you're sure fine. You yeah. You're fine. We're, we're reporters. We're just in here to take a look around the facility. And... Nope, you're not reporters. You're just ass-ass with the cameras, that's all. Let's see what's going on. You gotta go next door. There's stairs up there, and you can talk to um, our supervisor, but you can't be in here. It has to be probation for them. Yeah. I mean, the door's not locked or anything. I don't yeah, think that's a we're, we're fine. I'll go up there and talk to her in a minute. We're fine. Yeah. Thank you, though. You gotta, you, you kinda gotta, you gotta exit. This is for only for probation and parole. Is that a law? It's only for probation and parole. Restricted back there, right? It says restricted that. there. No, yeah. this is, this is right here is, you can't be here. People right? can't come in off the... No, 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 you can't. Just this is only for probation and parole. Door. That's right, you cockroaches. It may be a government building, but it's not open to the public, only to those who are on probation and parole. I mean, after all, if you were on probation or on parole, would you want anybody knowing about your business while you're in that office? Would you? Tell me the truth. Have you ever been on probation or parole? You seem like the kind of guy that would be. It's only for probation and parole. Hey, you gotta go. Then there needs to be a sign Excuse on the door. Excuse me. That's this is not. Listen. You have to go. You have to leave. That's not a law. This is no. You have to leave. Have we, this is only for probation. You, have you got a, you got a supervisor? I'd like to see, speak to your supervisor. Yeah, you're flipping you guys, out over some First guys, Amendment protected no, activity. Listen to me, you guys. I get it, but this is evidently this is, you no, don't. No, we it. work here. This is where we work. Yeah, here. absolutely. Yeah, and I understand that. You guys, but you're not working right you, now. You're broken. Listen, you're you... clearly broken. Nope, nope, nope. You and your gaggle of cockroaches are the ones that are clearly broken, thinking that you can just walk into a probation office and harass the employees like this. You never know what kind of stressful situation that they're going through back there that might antagonize somebody back there who you don't want to be antagonized, such as a former prisoner. You're got, breaking down. We got a supervisor. You're about to I'm cry. Not, I don't. Yeah, you're totally broken right now. Okay, you okay. lost your mind. Okay. Right. This is. We just have cameras. It's okay. No, but this is okay. for probation and parole. This is we, where we, we understand work. what it is. It, and it you guys can you, listen. You guys outside. can do that outside. You can. Oh, we can. And if do you that. want, listen. If you want to talk to our supervisors, it's in the next building over. Okay. Yeah, we'll get to them. But what I'm saying is, is that the press has a right to come into an, uh, a publicly accessible area. Even in probation offices, honey. <laughs> she, she don't say she... None of them listen. None of them want to hear She's because broken. they think they know. For reasons of security, the probation office is not a publicly accessible place. Sure, you can get in the lobby, but they won't welcome you there. I think they know everything, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So they're trying to push us out of a, a lobby here. This is clearly a lobby where people sit. Yeah. Ding, 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 ding! You're absolutely right. That is a lobby. You win the grand prize of this stopped clock, which is right twice a day, just like you. They printed them up on their little computer. Yeah, I think they can think they had authority and yeah. stuff. Just like that, no cell phone sign. I mean, come on, yeah. I, I can buy well, that. This one right here that says uh, cell phones must be turned on. Yeah, right. 
Yeah, they try. See, they try to they try to bully people because they think they can yeah. behind those doors. Well, they they can, can bully the probationers. That's right. That's what I'm saying. Behind yeah. that door, yeah, they can bully all they want. Yeah, I mean, even in here, the, the probationers, right. they're under probation. They can, yeah, they can tell them what to do all they want. Yeah. They're used to that. Yeah. Really? You really think that? I mean, a lot of those people that go through there are pretty much anti-authority and have a real problem with obeying the law. Why do you think they're in there to begin with? So, yeah, they, they called somebody to come down, their supervisor, hopefully. She said she's, she's working, and I said, no, you're working. Yeah, she said the supervisor is next door. Yeah. I'm going to go. Well, let's yeah, go. I want to go back to that. Yeah. yeah. I think they wanted to share that Two very boring minutes later. Jingle jangle. Jingle jangle. Is that the stairs? It says, please push buzzer on the wall. Uh, yes, the lady next door sent us over here to talk to a, a supervisor. She said upstairs. It says no gains. What the hell? <laughs> what? She's funny. That's exactly. Yes, we do. Let me. Can I? I gotta get some of this. Okay. Let me get on the side of it. Okay. I, I actually do. Here, let me give you the card. No, actually, don't. You gotta have my permission to have my image. You gotta have permission to have my image, sir. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Please don't, Phil. I don't want nobody to hurt you. Why would they hurt you? You got a mask on. Law enforcement. You guys have got to be the most brain-dead morons I've seen on here. I mean, she works for the Department of Corrections, which is a high-risk job. So it's only understandable that she doesn't want her picture taken for the safety of her and her family, you damn morons. I'm all the time in places I'll be back to danger things. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, well. Listen, your job's not that dangerous. Not that dangerous? Are you that brain dead? She works in the Department of Corrections, like I stated before. She has to deal with people on a daily basis who have the potential to get violent, and a lot of corrections officer open carry guns for their own safety. You think her job isn't dangerous? You should walk a mile in her shoes. I, I know. Uh, you don't know my job. I'm a probation officer. You do not know how dangerous. If, if you like candy ass, then you need to stop doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe walk. Yeah. Show his mind. I, I want. L listen, if you're that scared, I would try Walmart for a job. As someone who worked at Walmart myself, I can tell you it's a lot safer. But it doesn't pay as well as the Department of Corrections does. So I would am sure that she makes a lot more and would be able to support her family much better on the with the job she's got right there. It may be more dangerous, but it helps her out in the long run. Yeah, right? That way your family doesn't have to worry. Okay. Or maybe you should start filming the government. She's calling her papa. We were just over here to find the supervisor, that's all. Could you tell us where that is? Now she's mute. Holy cow. Freaking out. Like nobody ever took a picture before, you know what I mean? I guarantee if I Google Robes and Cat yeah, right? probation officers Boom. injured, yep. you'll come up with zero. Yep. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I'm on my way over here blocking the good stuff. Alright. <laughs> Let's see if we can get a close up. There we go. Now we got a close up. I see your pimples now. I see your pimples. Uh oh, she's calling. Yeah, they're down here. Uh -oh. I need them. I need them. They're in here. Oh, I so I need him to call the police and get them out of here. 
He said, I need them down here now to get them out of here. Okay. She's, they said, okay. Have to leave the building. Say what? Leave the building. Why? Because. Leave the building. Just because you don't like to be on camera? Don't you want to do a public Leave the building. Uh, yeah. Leave the building. He's trying to do a public Leave information the request. Ugh, now she's yelling at us. We have business here. Leave the Why? She's yelling at us now. Leave the building. You need to do your job, lady. Oh, she is doing her job to the best of her ability despite a bunch of incompetent frauditors impeding their business. You need to do if you say that five more times, I will. Four, four more times. Four more. She's pissed. <laughs> she is pissed. She, they fix to go hands on in here. Watch. Oh. Uh oh. I'm gonna hide behind you, John. <laughs> Let me get over here to the chair so if I need to throw one, I can. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Well, look at you, the potential convict and felon wanting to throw chairs at the workers in that building. What the hell is wrong with you? This is crazy. This is, uh, this is nuts. I gotta get a GoPro battery. <laughs> oh. oh, man. She is my, she is hot, boy. They're gonna say, I mean, there's nothing that Stop just from coming into the lobby. Right. Uh, we need a supervisor. They got a camera right there, so they know we're in here. We ain't. We can't do nothing. You know. Yep. Cockroaches back there. Look at that. Look at them in the hallway. Look at them cockroaches. Run, cockroaches, run. Look, they all huddled in the hallway back there. Look at them. Yeah, look at my phone. You see him? Cop, yeah. yeah, look at him. <laughs> Hiding back there. Y'all need to put this piece of damn door in so I can't see back there. <laughs> cockroaches. No, the only cockroaches I see in there are you guys. The rest of those people are people who are supposed to be in there going about their daily business, which is what you should be doing if you actually had jobs to go to. That's some funny stuff right there. I don't care who you are. That's funny. I don't give a damn who you are. I don't care who you are. That's, That's some funny, funny shit. Stuff. That's some funny shit right there. The only thing I find funny here is you guys, because you are a bunch of incompetent morons who fail at life. Well... That wraps it up here, folks. NC Tyrant Hunter attempted to audit a probation office and failed miserably at getting any reaction they wanted out of them. It just goes to show how much of a complete moron he is. He fails to understand the, even the simplest concepts of what secure building is all about. And until next time, have a good day, good night, or whatever. And don't forget to rate, comment, share, and subscribe. And I thank you very much for watching.